Thank you for tuning in to the Ontario Singles Crokinole Championship of 2024. Today, in this quarterfinal match, we have friends become competitors. Jeremy Tracy and Andrew Hutchinson will face off against each other. These two recently partnered together for the U.S. Open Crokinole Championship, placing third and are now facing off to take victory at this final tournament of the NCA Tour. Tracy will open up, giving Hutchinson first hammer. Knocks back out of the 20 hole, potentially a light touch opportunity here for Hutchinson. Doesn't get it, but instead lands between the pegs, giving Jeremy a tough shot here. Able to catch the peg, but rolls a little bit too far out. Hutchinson now will be content to keep play on the outside. Rolls back to the five. Very nice shot from Hutchinson. Jeremy, unless he can come in, will, yep, look to peel. If Hutchinson can get a 20 here, he will be in a very nice position, which he gets. Jeremy now left with a more difficult shot across the board. Peels it. Very nice shot. I don't know what Tracy is saying, but he's probably talking some smack to Hutchinson across the table. Hutchinson, unfazed by Tracy's shenanigans, drains another 20. Tracy overshoots on this one, and Hutchinson will be more than content to keep play on the outside. Maybe an opportunity for Tracy to come back in here off the peg. Almost gets it, but leaves a... Hanger opportunity for Hutchinson to get a third 20, which he converts. Shots now inconsequential as Hutchinson will be taking this first round. Players taking their last few shots. Jeremy going for a Hail Mary, flings some discs at Hutchinson. Players laughing, having a good time. Hutchinson drains that final 20 and takes the first round. Let's see some of these shots. We see that nice, easy drop back 20 from Hutch. And this up the line, open 20 shot. Very good first round. And Hutchinson will open the second round, giving Tracy hammer advantage. Hutchinson lifts off to the side, maybe giving Jeremy, yes, that angle and very nice shot. Hutchinson now misses again, going long. Not as easy a conversion. Never mind. Tracy draining that follow through 20. Up to 20s now with the hammer advantage. Hutchinson trying to equalize it out a bit, but Tracy will be looking to hold on to that 20 advantage. Players now both dialed in, going back and forth. It will come down to who messes up first. Certainly be more costly for Hutchinson if he loses this 20s race. But Tracy would also be in a little bit of danger if he missed a 20 at this point. Goes a little bit long if Hutchinson can convert this. Be very, very good for him. Let's see what he goes for. Goes long and far out. Tracy now will most likely be keeping play on the outside. Leaving Hutch's disc on the board. Not giving him a lot to work with whatsoever here. Jeremy now just needs to take out that one in the 10, and he will take this second round by five points, tying the score to 2-2 two -two now. We see this angle in, very nice shot from Tracy, and this follow through. The one catching me off guard, beautiful shot. Tracy now to open this third round, players tied at 2-2. Two -two. Tracy going long. On the right side of the hole, not giving Hutch an easy chance to convert, but he may just look to roll away. At the very least, not give Tracy a great opportunity for a 20, but he almost gets it off the post just a little bit short. Still not in an opportune spot for Hutch, but he might be able to get a follow through slight angle in for this 20. Rolls out and too far on the line, clears the board. Players now down to six discs each. Tracy lips out, maybe giving Hutch an angle in, but it looks like he'll be opting to just stay away from the 20, keeping strong board control. Very nice placement from Hutch. Tracy now will be looking to get play back to his side. Looks like that post was a little bit in the way, so opt just for the touch. 
touch keeps his disc on his side of the board, giving Jeremy only one to work with. Maybe going for an angle in. Doesn't get it and goes far. Hutch again will more than likely be staying on the outside here, which he does. Probably looking not to set Jeremy up for a double. Tracy gets a nice Hutch 20 there, but Hutch with three discs on the board and an open 20 opportunity right now. With Hammer is not at all in a bad position. With that 20 drain is in control of this round. Tracy does leave Hutch with a difficult shot now. The two discs on the board now blocking his path, making this somewhat more difficult. He opts a touch from the outside, keeping his on. Doesn't get the off, but Tracy needs to clear up some discs on the board. If he takes off the one red and the 10, he will guarantee the tie. He might be wondering if he can get the double there. Thin line through Hogan's. See what he chooses to go for. Oh, double from over there. Hutch now just needs to promote his to the 10 and he will take this round by 10 points. Very good attempt from Tracy there to take that round back. See these 20s from both players in this very nice double attempt from Tracy. Alas, Hutch takes this third round, bringing the score to four to two. Hutch now to open. Going long seems to be a theme amongst these players. Tracy looked like he was trying to follow through, goes a little bit long. Maybe a touch opportunity here for Hutchinson. Tracy has the hammer, so pressure right now is on Hutch to make something happen. Tracy, oh, Hutch's Hutch's disc, but loses his own shooter in the process. Definitely not what he was looking for. Hutch going for the angle in, very close to the 20, twice as he almost comes back off the peg. And Tracy gets that 20 advantage with the hammer in a nice spot now. Has two options. He can either go for that hanger, which is exactly what he does. Very nice shot from Tracy. Hutch. Misses again, and Tracy to go for that outside disc. Hutchinson will be looking to come in. Goes in and back out off the pegs. Very unfortunate. Tracy happy <laughs> about that shot. Chuckling at his friend, and Hutch almost knocks his own disc in, but not quite. That was extremely close. Tracy opening the door for Hutchinson to get a 20. Hutch is not mathematically out of it right now but Tracy would have to really goof up this last shot to give up the round which he doesn't takes his fourth round the score is now tied 4-4 players going back and forth this is an awesome match in my opinion I might be biased because two of my favorite people here someone I love and cherish dearly and then also my father so let let me know what you think in the comments of this this match Tracy going long again for his opening shot. Hutch now debating between following through or rolling away a little bit. Ops to keep play away from that 20. Looks like Tracy was trying to catch that peg to bring play back closer to the middle. Hutch now not left with an easy shot with that disc. Dangerously close to the peg. Follows through, bringing play closer to Jeremy now, who almost drops a 20 for Hutch. Also leaves some set up. If Hutch can convert this, he will be in a very good spot, which he does, leaving one of his own discs on the outside. Tracy will be forced to peel. And if Hutch can drain a 20 now, he will be very much in control of this round. Drains it, very nice shot. Tracy has an uphill battle for his remaining shots. Drains a 20, but hoping for a mistake out of Hutch. Unfortunately for him, Hutch is not much for making mistakes. Drains his third 20s. Players going back and forth now. Hutch holding a 120 advantage. Does miss. And Tracy will be going for a follow through. 
does follow through but doesn't get that slight angle that he needed for the 20. And Hutch will be more than content to keep play between the discs there. Tracy needs to catch a peg and doesn't get it. Looks like Hutch will be taking this round, bringing the score to six to four. See this hanger opportunity that Hutch takes advantage of. Nice shot from Hutchinson, who will be opening this next round. Tracy having the hammer. Hutch goes long. I feel like I'm repeating myself on those opening shots. Tracy with a creative off, as one may say, leaving Hutchinson with an angle and opportunity, which he drains. Tracy now hoping to equalize the 20s cup. Players with six shots each remaining. Hutchinson taking his time as we're into the later half of this round. Hutch going long and Tracy content just to keep play away from the 20. Be up to Hutch to bring play back close to the center. Very close to the 20 hole. Tracy will need either a follow through but opts to stay between the pegs. Not at all bad placement from Tracy. Tracy now very happy just to keep play away. Forcing Hutch to try to catch a peg here. Again, very risky, but doable for these players. Catches a few pegs, but doesn't get the off. Tracy now, if he can get Hutch's disc off, very nice spot now. Hutchinson will be trying to angle in to get up in the 20s cup. And he gets it. Very nice shot from Hutchinson. If Tracy can, he doesn't get this 20. He is currently up by five points, including all the discs in the 20, as well as the ones on the board. Hutchinson will be looking for either a double or for an off and a 20. I believe those are his options. I believe he's going for that follow through we'll see what this shot turns out to be and doesn't get it but leaves his shot near a post Tracy doesn't get the off giving Hutchinson this round very unfortunate that last disc was close to the peg so it was a tough shot for Tracy last that round will go to Hutch bringing the score to eight to four. You see that disc very close to the peg. What Hutch thought was a mistake was actually his winning defensive shot of the round. Tracy opens with a 20. Both players now dialed in. Tracy knows. Never mind. He does know. Hutch is one round away from ring, I think. Goes way too long on that last shot. Pressure now on Tracy almost catches peg and almost goes back in sorry he did catch the peg almost goes back in the 20 but not quite and if hutch can convert this he will be dominating this round doesn't quite get it leaves his close to the 20 as well maybe a conversion opportunity for tracy which he gets hutchinson still not at all in a bad position even if he doesn't get this 20 he will Still being a good spot. Tracy now looking for a double or a 20. Hutchinson, if he's able to keep the board like this till the end of the round, will win this quarterfinal match. Oh no! I said he needed a 20. I should have clarified. Tracy drains a 20 for Hutchinson, now tied in the 20s cup, and soon to have two on the board. Tracy will be looking for something big here catches a peg in the right direction just slightly off on the angle Hutchinson now most likely content to hit and just keep play away from the center <laughs> very nice spot neither of Hutch's discs in a kind position at all both in between the posts on the side Tracy will be looking for something magical here 
And that was not it. Loses his own shooter. Hutchinson now does have hammer, but doesn't want to give Tracy any opportunity on his final shot to get a 20. Drains that last shot, and that seals around Tracy, <laughs> losing his last disc as a projectile towards Hutchinson as Hutchinson takes the final round and wins his quarterfinal match. Very good performances from both players. Hutchinson now will be moving on to the semi-final round. Stay tuned as we will have more quarterfinal matches coming your way and soon the semi-final matches after that as Hutchinson will fight for the championship win. Thank you for tuning in and as always, make it a great day.